The old has passed away. Behold, the new has come. There are two young fish swimming along who happen to meet an older fish. The older fish nods at them and says, Morning, boys. How's the water? The two young fish swim on for a bit, and then eventually one of them looks over at the other and asks, What's water? I want to live my life closer to thee. David Foster Wallace told this story in a commencement speech called, This is Water. What do you think of this story? You ever feel like you could use a change of perspective? Have you ever looked around at your life and suddenly thought, what's going on around me? What kind of world am I living in? How am I to see myself in this story? Sometimes what we need precisely is a change of perspective. Apostle Paul says it this way in 2 Corinthians chapter 5, verse 17. Therefore, if anyone is in Christ, he is a new creation. The old has passed away. Behold, the new has come. When you look at this world, what do you see? Do you see people as constant disappointments, never able to meet your expectations? We need a change of perspective. Indeed, Sin has marred every aspect of our lives. But if the new has come and the old has passed away, what's this new thing? What does it mean to be in Christ? Paul explains in verses 14 to 16 of 2 Corinthians chapter 5. The love of Christ controls us because we have concluded this, that one had died for all, therefore, all have died, and he died for all, that those who live might no longer live for themselves, but for him who for their sake died and was raised. When you hear the voice of a customer service agent on the phone who's frustratingly unable to help you, what if you were hearing someone who Jesus died for? Would that change your conversation? When you hear the voice of a politician on the radio using the talking points that grate on you every time you listen to them, what if you knew Jesus died for her? Would you pray for her instead of being driven by hate to complain and bicker? Christ has changed our world. When it seems as if no person is good, no situation is good, no political party is good, we have a God who is good. Jesus changes our world, our lives, because he died to redeem them. For those who saw Jesus as just another teacher, he changed their perspective with his resurrection. May Jesus change your perspective. When you look at the world and its brokenness, may you see Jesus and how he's making all things new. Pray with me. Heavenly Father, you've changed everything. You've changed me through Jesus' death and resurrection. Help me to see everything through your eyes, through the eyes of the cross. Help me to love like Jesus. In his name we pray. Amen. Thanks for joining us. If you're seeking services for symptoms of mental illness, please talk to your primary doctor or a health professional. Don't have one? Consider one of the resources listed here to find help. And God's peace to you.